My name is Craig Hutchinson. Um, I work within the Information Systems Department. Before I uh, became an apprentice here, I worked as a chef, uh, a restaurant chef, for four years. And alongside that, I'd done a BTEC Level 3 uh, National Diploma. But that was what I wanted to do. I studied IT, just done chefing as like a, you know, it's good money at the time for when I was younger. And now I, I can't believe like the job changed completely. It's like, it's a dream. And it's something I actually really enjoy as well, which made it even better. My name is Jonathan Taylor. Uh, my job role is finance apprentice. Prior to my apprenticeship, I worked in a shoe shop selling trainers to people. <laughs> so I work within the accounts department. I'm studying towards becoming an accountant. Well, I did try university in the past. I didn't really enjoy it, so I ended up not finishing it. That's how I ended up working in a shop. <laughs> But when I thought of apprenticeship, I, was, I thought, oh, you know, you're constantly following someone, you're like a shadow, you're not doing really much, you're just watching and taking notes. You know, you wouldn't be let, let loose on the systems as such, you know, they wouldn't allow you, like, you know, you couldn't, you couldn't touch that because it's, you know, we need someone that's been experienced in that area. But I came into our co and from, like, day one, I was, in a sense, pushing the deep end, but in my opinion, I prefer that, and you just, you know, you just get stuck in. So you get, you get chosen really as a valued employee straight away, you, you know, you, you're already within a team, you're already accepted as the team. Um, you just feel like, you know, I'm an apprentice, but I'm still needed. My name's Cameron Wartnerby, and I'm the layout department apprentice. I think the apprenticeship's been different to what I thought it would be. I, I think it's been a lot better. I feel like it's been one of the best decisions I've ever made to, to take the apprenticeship on. I feel like I learned better doing hands-on work than a lot of theory work. I mean, I do go to college at the moment, and I, I really enjoy it, but... I prefer the hands-on experience. My name is Jake Hobbs and I'm the Apprentice Metallurgical Technician. The best bit about being an apprentice is getting the education while earning, and especially when you see your friends in uni, <laughs> and you, uh, you kind of tell them that you're getting paid to do the stuff that they're going to be in debt for doing. It's, uh, I, just, I just find it a really great idea. My name's Dan James and I'm an Electrical Engineering Apprentice at Alcoa Helmet. So I saw an opportunity to improve myself, improve my, well, improve, get better grades, and then have something to actually, oh yeah, have something to get a job with. I'm in my la last year now, and even before finishing, I've got a whole bunch of skills I can use at work, at home, which I wouldn't have had it had I not joined the apprenticeship scheme here. The good thing about the job role that I do is within IT, there's there's loads of things to do. It's never a dull day in IT. I enjoy it so much, like, you know, I actually get up and want to go to work. It's not one of those sort of things where I was chefing, oh, you know, got to go into work, got to do a 12 hour shift. But now I'm like, what problem we've got today? The things I enjoy most, all the people uh, here are great. They're so enthusiastic, they love what they do. Uh, they all love working for Alcoa. And then also the opportunity to travel around, because I've never really got to travel that much, so. I get to go to lots of different cities now with the company um, and obviously travelling out to America as well and that's something I don't think I'd have been able to do. It's a global company at the end of the day, you know, you've got that on your CV, you go into like an IT department or an IT company and go, like I worked for Alcoa for four years in an apprenticeship, your opportunities are endless. I can say one thing for sure that it's definitely impacted me is my confidence. Believe it or not, I wasn't, I wasn't very confident. Um, and then coming to Alcoa, it's definitely brought out the confidence in me. Meeting people face to face, speaking to people that I've never met before, um, going up to them and you know, finding out what their problem is with their computer. Like you know, live meetings where I'm talking to 200 odd people, you know, within IT. It's you know, it's, that's another element that's built my confidence up. Is actually being able to speak up. My long term goals after the apprenticeship, uh, I just want to get as far. I possibly can and I think being part of our co is really going to help me with that. A lot of the managers here are started out as apprenticeships. You get confidence in yourself, especially when you start seeing your work kind of and it starts getting valued and uh, it's made me more into a better person I find. I definitely recommend apprenticeships just because it's, it's in my eyes the better way. You're, you're earning while doing all the qualifications which are all to the same level and it's just it's just find it so much more fun.
so much more enjoyable, get so much more out of it. They actually have time for apprentices here, you know, they treat you like an employee at the end of the day, they're not like thinking he's like, you know, the bottom of the pile, he can be, you know, he can do the rubbish jobs, but it's not like that at all. I've never had a job that I've enjoyed so much. It's it will have had a massive impact on my life. This is my career. Without this opportunity, I'd probably still be working in a shop selling trainers to people. So, <laughs> and that's not really uh, something I wanted to do for the rest of my life. Happier now.